get a Ritzia. situation but they only have it in white I really want the black ones but they only have it in the oh you can come this way I'm glad I get that close <laughs> to my face <laughs> okay. Factory was a hit. Thank you, baby, for choosing that. Thank you. I haven't had that in so long. Mm -hmm. Um, do y'all make y'all man choose what to eat? Because <laughs> I do. Yep. Because I never know what I want. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on, y'all. I gotta focus when I'm reversing out. Reverse. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm. To the left, take it back now, y'all. One hop this time, mm. one hop this time. Mm. Wait, what's for? Oh man! Slide to the left, mm. slide to the right. Mm. Reverse, 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 reverse. Mm. 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 <laughs> That's so dirty. Thank you, man. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, so we are going to, next we're going to Trader Joe's because we have to be adults and get groceries. I just can't be out here shopping. I found a few things. I'm going to show y'all when I get home. Um, What I found, it was only a few, a few items, so y'all, like for real, for real. Oh, wait, I should, probably should have kept straight. Should I have kept straight? Mm -hmm. Whoopsies. Hey, Lexi. Lexi. Yeah, thanks. Instead of Lexus, you know, Lexi. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. Oh, I am so sorry. I don't even know where to start. Okay, all right, I'm just gonna go. So sorry. Oopsies. This is where I should follow directions. And you, my friends. Oh, sorry, y'all. Okay, so we are trying to get out of the parking lot. I need a phone holder for the car, babe. Yeah, I noticed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. <laughs> Remember this place, babe? Mm hmm Restoration Hardware. Okay, so we went to RH Restoration Hardware uh, restaurant and it was okay it's really for the aesthetics to be honest thanks thanks tessie <laughs> it's really for the aesthetics <laughs> but the food i really was were you a fan of the food babe it was like small plates type yeah of it was small plates it was cute like, you want to take pictures. right i about to say it's cute for but if, yeah but if you hungry hungry hippo i wouldn't i wouldn't go there do not recommend because we likes to eat over here okay we likes to eat, okay? Turn it 20 second. All right, y'all. Let's listen to some music because I gotta focus on directions right now. Taking my Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all, 
y'all what I got from Trader Joe's. I I feel like y'all probably already seen this stuff before because people be doing like Trader Joe's hauls, you know. But let me show you what I got because you ain't seen what I got before. We got some mini milk chocolate peanut butter cups. These are a hit. Nice little snackity snack. And then y'all will never freaking guess. We got freaking tuna. So first off, let me just say this. I never, ever, ever, ever liked tuna until Bebe made tuna. And Bebe be making tuna. It is so, okay. <laughs> we got the PB and J bars. Bebe usually likes that for like a quick, quick breakfast. This is some chicken broth. Ooh, this. The Argentinian shrimp. Girl, love that shrimp for my little quesadilla. Some shrimp burgers. We got these last time, so this is our second time having them and they're actually pretty, pretty good. And then my friend Jazz put me onto these. Girl, these little peach halves with um like soaked in white grape juice. It's good. That was dramatic, but it really is good though, for real, for real. We got eggs. Don't even get me started on the price of eggs. Okay. But glory to the Father, because we have it to even buy it. So thank you, Jesus. I'm not trying to sound ungrateful. But Lord, let the prices go down, please. No. Um, I feel like I showed y'all this before in like a few vlogs ago. But the um, Belgian waffles, these are good. These are my fave. Oh, this is good too. It's the Spanish style rice. We tried this last month and it was actually pretty good. So we got it again. Ooh, please tell me we got some chips because I really want some tuna right now. And I'm I can't ask Wavy to make it because today is All Star. Well, All Star Weekend. The three the three point shoot is tonight, right? Yeah. The three, dunk contest. Dunk contest. Three point Skills shooter. Challenge. Skills challenges tonight. It literally starts in two minutes. One minute. So that's what he has on right now. I'm still full from that cheesecake. So we are about to put this stuff up. And then I'll show y'all what I got from um from Crate and Barrel. Or should I just show y'all that right now? Hold on, I'm gonna actually show y'all that right now because I got one thing from Crate and Barrel, girl. I got um let's see. Oh, and it's for kitchen too, so it's perfect. I got these waffle towels for my kitchen because can y'all believe I did not have towels in the kitchen? Okay, so it's the waffle terry dish towel if y'all want this i'll link this one they feel so good like super super good it was um how much was this 14.95 and it's for a set of two so yeah if you like waffle towels it's a hit and it's black um i need to wash these though and yeah, I can't believe I didn't have towels, but your girl didn't have no kitchen towels up in here. I was using paper towels. And if you're anything like me, I be going through paper towels. Like, girl, do I go through paper towels and tissue? I need to be having a membership at Costco or Sam's Club. So, mm, 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 mm. Hit me up, Costco, Sam's Club. Mm, mm, mm. I got all this energy right now, y'all. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure once I lay down, Ooh, don't look at my pics. I need to shave per huge. I'm gonna be a little bit tired. I'm gonna be a little bit tired. Okay. Cause I'm I'm just mouthing right now. Let's let's put up this stuff. Okay, here we go. Alright, so we didn't brush our hair already. I'm put on my little headband. Oh, let's watch a tribute to the winings. I haven't 
and see that y'all see how my head moving off. This. Here we go. And show y'all what I got from um Sephora. So I got this um hair perfume by I do not know how to pronounce this. So can I just tag it for y'all? But I have the bum bum cream and it smells delicious. We got faded topicals. It's a brightening and clearing mist. I think it's a spray because I want to put this on tonight. Oh, oh, it's misty, misty. So I was We got that. Um, it's a gentle cleansing oil. Um, a mild cleansing oil with refreshing texture that gently removes makeup and impurities while leaving skin well moisturized. So this is what I'm gonna start with first. I did not take off my lashes. I'm reusing these, I don't care, hold on. Save the lashes. Okay, sorry, I know that I rushed out the house just now, but your girl was running late. Um, we already went to the church to set up, so now I'm about to grab us some breakfast real quick before church actually starts, because our church, we start at 1 p.m., but we get there early for setup. Hi, today. Hi, I'm good, how are you? Good, thanks, what's going on? What can we get for you? Um, do you have banana nut loafs today? We do. Okay, may I have two warm, please? Okay. And then can I also have a venti pineapple with lemonade refresher with uh, no dry fruit on top? Okay. And I'm gonna try this new drink. Um, can I try a grande pink drink with oat milk? Instead of the coconut? Instead of the coconut, yes. Okay. Um, vanilla syrup, I think. <laughs> syrup, okay. And a scoop of matcha. Just one scoop? Yes, just one scoop. And then is okay. it possible that we can do like the vanilla sweet foam on top? Yeah, we can have the cold foam on top. Okay, and then I'll do that. And then that'll be all. Okay. You Thank nice. you. You too. All right, y'all. So this is how it looks. I thought it would have been a little bit more pink, but I definitely see the strawberries in there. So... Hopefully I like it. Oh, y'all still got my edges laying. Okay, hold on. First of all, I need to take this headband off. Just in there with the headband on. Um. Okay, so don't talk about me. But sometimes like when we're setting up on Sundays, um, I'll like have my bonnet on. Not bonnet, like my uh hairnet thing. Like to keep my hair like fresh because sis be this be sweating and I don't want it to sweat like before service I'm already gonna cry my makeup off the least that could be done is my hair minimal let me see let me take this off real quick I feel like every time I come on here I'd be apologizing about my armpits y'all I hate oh crap I got that line on my head oh well and my brush is in the church whatever um what's I trying to say oh the time it takes to get the hair off of my full body is ridiculous. What am I, a grizzly bear? Between my legs, my pits, my arms now, because I started narrowing my arms for whatever reason, because I like the way it feels, but that just gives me one more task. Oh, thanks, sis. Sorry. I know you like, get out of my way. I just stopped right here in the middle of the parking lot. 
So yeah, we finna go to church. And I'm so excited. <laughs> I just saw one of my bros from church. Um, Y'all, I'm just really, really excited. This morning I was like um, in prayer and um, well, y'all saw it, but I feel like there's just so much going on in the world right now, but not only in the world, right? We already knew that, but there's so much going on within the body of Christ and within the church right now. I needed some encouragement that like the gates of hell shall not prevail. Like upon this rock, the Lord built his church and nothing will prevail against the church of God. So we just have to keep praying. Um, and it hurts my heart as a believer, as an intercessor, as just a child of God. Like it really hurts my heart to see the church not unified. Um, yeah, I just can't. I'm gonna get emotional. I really can't. It really, I just feel like if you are the bride of Christ, like, just pray that you have the heart of God because like I want to feel what he feels and it really hurts my heart to see the body of Christ is just in this place right now where we're just not as unified as we need to be and I don't know man I want us to get on the one as my church would say let's get on the one you know like so i just say that to say i'm not gonna even like go into detail about it because it it literally overwhelms me with how much prayer so i'm just gonna say it's just pray so it's just keep praying stay before the face of god ask him for his discernment his wisdom his heart his mind like yeah crucify this flesh and for me to just have the speech of Christ that is so important like I really want to speak the things of God and I really want to speak the way Jesus spoke and yeah I, I want to have the characteristics of God that's what I'm trying to say I really just want to have the characteristics of Christ yeah, I don't want flesh to be in the way. I don't want Courtney to be in the way. I don't want this world to be in the way. I don't want the enemy, the stupid devil to be in the way. Like, I just want to have the characteristics of Christ. That's it. That's all. All right, let's go in church. I'm so excited. I love Sundays, y'all. I love being able to be in his face, in his presence with my brothers and sisters in Christ. And don't get me wrong. It's not peachy all the time. Like, being a believer be, like, hardcore some days, you know? But... I appreciate the days now where I can come into the house of God because everybody doesn't have that, you know, that pleasure of going into the house of God. And I don't want to take that for granted. I don't want to take my brothers and sisters in Christ for granted. I don't want to take my leaders for granted. I don't want to take the Lord's church for granted. And I do not want to take his bride for granted. I love being his bride, but I also love serving his bride. So I want to continue to be in that place. All right, let's go because I'm yapping now. <laughs> And we are back at home. Girl, it's 10 27 <laughs> p.m. at night. I'm not taking off my face because um, I gotta edit. So we're in my office, me and Bebe's office. The reason why y'all haven't seen this room is because I'm not, I haven't finished decorating it yet. So it's still like a storage slash office space because yeah. <laughs> I don't really, I kind of know what I want to do for the room, but I really don't know what I want to do for the room yet. So maybe we can decorate this room together. But I don't know like how soon that'll be. So don't, don't hold me on that. But um, yeah, so I'm just about to edit right now because I really want to get this video out for you all tomorrow, which is technically President's Day, right? I think, yeah. Um, I want to get this video out for y'all tomorrow. So I need to edit it today because I don't know about y'all, but like my stuff takes forever in a day to like edit and I don't have time. So I'm thinking if I edit today, then I can post tomorrow. My take, my stuff takes forever in a day to upload. I'm sorry, not edit, um, to upload, even though editing takes a long time too. So, um, we're just going to like vibe out. 
I would even show y'all how I edit, but I mean, I don't know. If y'all want to see it, I will definitely show y'all. Actually, yeah, I'll turn y'all around so y'all can see what I have. I feel like I should probably screen share this because I don't feel like this is really giving y'all too much. But basically, I'm going to like close some... I had one already before and I'm going to create a new project. I'm just going to name this one um, Weekend Vlog. Right? And then press OK. And so now I'm just starting with a blank canvas. Then I press this little arrow, if you all can see that here in this corner. In the top left hand corner, it's like a down arrow. I'm going to click on that. And then all of my stuff is literally just going to like pop up, which majority of this stuff, honestly, is like church and blogging. So, yeah. And then I just import the videos that I want. I choose which videos I want. And then I just add it to my project and I just kind of edit it from there. Um, so, yeah, that's all I use is Final Cut Pro. Um, I also have my iPad on me because I listen to music sometimes I watch other vlogs just for like inspiration especially when it comes to like editing stuff um I'm just so new to it but I mean people get inspiration from everywhere and I just feels like this puts me in my creative artistic um artist vibe and then I don't know if I told y'all sis got a new baby and she is looking good okay I am so happy. So I got the Canon 80D. Um, it came with this lens, but I actually bought another lens for this camera and it comes in tomorrow. Um, let me try that. This tripod is heavy. I got this tripod too. But this is the back of the camera. It is actually very heavy. So I definitely see why people don't use this to vlog and they use it as a more like a sit down video type of camera. But um, I love this camera so far. I literally have no complaints and I just feel so blessed to even be able to get it, to be honest with you. <laughs> um, I also bought, bought this tripod at the same time. I purchased a light. And if you guys want that like equipment that I have, I will send it over. Oh, that's, you're probably right in my face. Sorry, girl. Let me put you back up. Um, I will link the stuff if you guys want it, if you want to see what equipment I have. But I honestly, that's now my new standstill camera. I have the um, Sony ZV-1 as my vlogging camera, what I'm using right now. And um, yeah, that's it. I don't, I don't really use anything else. I use this light. I know a lot of girls like do videos and stuff as far as like the equipment that they use for their YouTube, but because I don't use that much equipment, I feel like this is like the beginner's starting pack. <laughs> um, I use this light and it is very, very bright. Like, girl, it is bright. So I use this light usually and I just clip it on here. So that's what I have. I also use this, I put my, I don't know what this is called, but I purchased it from Apple or Amazon. I don't know, but um, I have a couple of these, but it's for me to put my SD card in so that I can import everything um, to my computer. I also have this small little Manfrotto tripod. I also have the medium sized Manfrotto tripod and then Oh no, this is the newer tripod. This thing is so heavy back here. Like, that's my big boy. Like, I don't be wanting to move her. I'm trying to think of what else I have. Um, oh, and then I have my external hard drive. I would recommend this to every content creator. Like, instead of storing all of that on your computer, like, because it takes up so much space and I don't want it to, like, damage your computer or you don't get a good run out of your computer add everything to the external hard drive because yeah it will just make your life so much easier and honestly it'll be easier to um 
to edit too. So yeah. Okay. Um. So yeah, that's that's pretty much all I have. I don't think I use anything else. Any other equipment you see in here is my husband's because he's a producer, as you guys know already. Um. So yeah. That's pretty much my starter pack. I mean, if you oh, and I have a ring light. I have this this big ring light. Um, which I feel like y'all have saw that in like past hauls or something already, maybe. But yeah, I just have a ring light. But like I said, I will um, I'll add it if y'all just want to see it. But until then, we are about to just vibe out, um, and stay up. Maybe even pull an all nighter because. Yeah, just, I have to finish this today and I, I really want to post this for y'all tomorrow. I just have so many ideas of like videos I want to do now and I feel like I asked God to just like renew like my passion and to just help me creatively and he's done that and so now I just don't want to drop the ball with it. I'm like, okay, you got the drive now, like you got the passion now to do, you know, what you said you wanted to do honestly years ago like I remember years ago wanting to be on be a youtuber and I was just there was always just not an excuse but there was just always like a hindrance uh like a self-hindrance that I kind of put on myself because I like I said before like I was really a perfectionist so I'm like okay well I don't have this I don't have that and then I waited and I'm like dang Courtney if you would have just started like three, four years ago, you know, like you wanted to, like who knows where you could have been now. But I really can't honestly think like that though. Like this is the timing that got the timing that the Lord has me on. And honestly, I feel like the content that I make now, I wouldn't have made three or four years ago. Like I wouldn't have had the same mindset. Like my mindset now is like this is another avenue for me, honestly, to to tell people about Jesus <laughs> and also I just really enjoy and not trying to be deep but like I really enjoy like being a vlogger I really enjoy YouTube I'm learning and loving to enjoy editing um and pushing myself like create creatively like there are so many girls on here there are so many gifted beautiful young girls on here older women on here that are just like amazing at like what they do and um it's just really inspiration so i love it i really want to get this workout for y'all i have so many ideas like i said i don't know if i'm gonna like end the vlog after tonight or if i'm gonna vlog tomorrow morning too because i kind of i kind of got some things i want to do tomorrow <laughs> but it's my off day and if you work a nine to five and you're also trying to get your business up and running, then you understand. Like those off days, you can kind of be like, ooh, like, yeah, I got my nine to five off, but I really need to work on my business. <laughs> like if you know, you know, basically.